someone doesn't feel that you gave them enough time please scroll on if this doesn't resonate okay and i think this might be someone who's questioning everything now like maybe even just kind of like hey where'd you go what's going on i don't know why you didn't give enough, enough time i'm gonna pull some cards multi-talented there's they have a very high opinion of you very high and this is something that's really weighing heavily on their mind they feel like you just didn't give them a chance not ready to give up and i need more time they're questioning okay question everything that's them like they're curious about you they're questioning everything about you and about how multi-talented you are like they just didn't expect you to come along that's what i just thought they're um mm, they thought you were more simple they did not realize how complicated you are um fear of rejection that's why they're not coming in they do want more time but it's like they need to tell you that right at least i that's what i think if they're just behind your back like questioning and whatever i don't know what you did like i feel like somebody pushed when i say what you did i mean you pushed them away for some reason and you probably had your reasons big changes they are watching you go through some big changes they are going through some big changes as well whoa okay i wanted things to be different they want okay okay that makes sense they um mm, they feel like this was a matter of timing bad timing i feel you slipping away you already did they okay look at this look at like the almost the same blue sad face um very sad very sad they i mean they really feel like this was just some kind of unfair rejection for them like they don't understand why you don't see it they don't understand why you are being weird that's what i just got <laughs> they don't mean it in a bad way it's not like you're really weird it just means like they think that it's so obvious that this connection should happen or that you should work together whatever it is whoa whoa you changed me forever and you changed my life forever now i make my decks and i did this on purpose i do stuff like this on purpose so that when they come out together it's confirmation and yeah they, they're okay when i tell you they're sad this is a very deep feeling person who they just can't believe it they can't believe it like this i need more time like this is like them begging for more time these hands like uh wow you whatever you did i don't even know if you knew the person for that long you changed them forever you sparked some huge massive change in their life you are divinely guided huh okay they see you very spiritual they see you being divinely guided that's why they're afraid not to they're afraid to come in because they know that you're someone who's not going to put up with any crap any garbage you know they know whoa clear mind and not too good to be true there okay this right here tells me they want to come correct they want a clear mind they're not going to drunk text you you know what i mean they want to have a good conversation with a clear mind and they want you to know that they're not too good to be true this is a strong connection if this is for you like i don't know why you cut it off and i don't know who this person is to you but i'm you know i manifest that somebody will come into your mind right now um but i also you know let's manifest okay what three cards do you need from this deck well, god what do you need to tell these people about this connection like it's just wow they changed my life forever that blows me away you okay no weapon formed against you shall prosper you have control over your thoughts and nothing is impossible for you you know this is i, I feel like what's happening is they see you going down a path like they know you're divinely guided look two things about a path here they want to get a they want to get a, a piece of this they they just want to know what your secret is why how are you so talented how is you have you been undiscovered for so long they feel like they've discovered a diamond in the rough or not even that like a talent scout like out at some small town be like whoa this person's as talented as someone in you know the big cities whatever you know that's what they are they're thinking is they want to protect you that's what i'm getting from this no weapon formed against you shall prosper like they don't think things do prosper against you weapons like that's what they, they think you are they're like you are already got divinely guided they don't they know they can't really add anything that you've already got going on they are they know they can't add anything so they got to come correct they've got to come with a clear mind and they really want to get to know you okay you have control over your thoughts um they want to get into your thoughts and know what you're thinking seriously they're very enamored that's the word i'm getting enamored by you someone who just wants to sit back and watch you and listen to you and just wow they, they see you doing everything things that they only dreamed of, of doing themselves they are so jealous of you 
Anyway, nothing is impossible for you, and I want you to be encouraged by this. That's what this connection is. You let them come to you, though. Don't you dare reach out to them. Nothing is impossible for you. It is spoken. It is written. And so it is. Amen.